Today we're going to show just how easy it is to interface a DataLogic QuickScan QD2100 scanner with our Omni server Universal OPC server. So to start, I'm going to go to my interfaces section in my user manual. You can see here the interfaces that are available. What I'm interested in is the USB uh, COM emulation. So as you can see here, there's a barcode that I would scan with my scanner to configure it for USB COM emulation to an RS-233 232 standard interface, which is what I need to connect my Omni server via a COM port. Also in the manual, we can then go to our Appendix B for the default values for the baud, rate, data bits, stop bits, parity for that COM port once it's emulated. So I've got 9600 baud, 8 data bits, 1 stop bit, no parity, and no handshaking control. I need to remember those for when I'm configuring my COM port in Omni server later. I also need a USB COM driver which is downloadable from the datalogic.com website and I need to have that installed on the machine where my USB barcode scanner is going to be plugged in in order to emulate that to a COM port. As you can see here, this is the zip file that was downloaded and I installed the driver from that. Then if I go to my control panel, system, then I can go into my device manager, look at my COM ports to see what COM COM number was assigned to that COM port. So you see here I have my barcode scanner was mapped to COM5. This allows me to then have enough information to open up my Omni server and I'm going to go ahead and configure a new COM port <coughs> using the settings that I found out from my manual and from the device manager. So I'll select COM5 and you'll see my default COM parameters in OmniServer actually already match up exactly with the defaults from the manual. So all I have to do is click OK there. And we have a barcode sample protocol that you can see here that installs with every OmniServer. And it's always a good place to start with respect to trying to connect to any sort of barcode scanner because the formats are typically similar. So there's my code item. Here's my barcode message. And you'll see that all my message is simple. It's just composed of my barcode followed by a carriage return special character. So that will get us started. So I have my protocol, I have my device. The next step is to configure a topic which marries those two together and is what I will access. So I'm just going to give this a representative name, QD2100. I'll put in a description, my data logic QD2100 scanner. Then I need to select that barcode protocol and my COM5 COM port that I configured. Now at that point, I'm ready to start doing some testing. So just so I can see what's going on with my protocol, I go to the I.O. monitor and select my COM5. And that's going to allow me to see the data that's coming in from that barcode scanner. And I open my OPC test client that installs with OmniServer, make a connection. You'll see I'm connected. I need to add an OPC group. Now I'm browse. There's my topic, QD2100. There's my item code. I need to add that and I make sure I'm subscribed to it. So now I'm connected to OmniServer specifically to my barcode tab at this tag at this point. Now here, since I can't really show you, here are the sample barcodes that I have on my desk right now. I have a package of, of macaroni and cheese with the barcode and a package of Ghirardelli dark chocolate with the barcode. These are the products I'm going to be scanning to dem for this demonstration. So back in my test client, you'll see I just scanned my mac and cheese barcode. So, and if I bring up bring that up, you'll see that it matches matches with the barcode for that product. So zero one three five six two three zero two one zero nine matches up with the value in my OPC test client. And then if I scan my dark chocolate, you'll see that value came through and it matches up seven four seven five nine nine three zero eight nine four nine. So that matches up matches up with what the value that was scanned into my tag, pursed into my tag via OmniServer and up into my OPC client. So now if we go over here and we look at the the I.O. monitor that I brought up in OmniServer, the diagnostics tool, you'll see these are the raw values being received uh, from the COM5 virtual COM port. As you can see we have our raw barcode followed by our carriage return which exactly matches our barcode sample protocol.